And so, we breach the sanctum of the ancients, the first footfalls in this tomb for centuries. This place gives me the creeps after you. Now, for the last, you are an exemplary student, Lara, although you have not yet learned the root of all adventuring, the craving to win at whatever cost. I throw down the gauntlet to you, my child. Whoever is first to the iris claims the prize. Watch your back, old man. I warn you, I'll pull no punches. <laughs> I expected no less. On the count of three, one... Two. And so the pupil excels the master. I congratulate you on your agility. Take your prize from the plinth. You have earned it. In the time it took you to find your way here, I've examined the inscriptions. It warns of vengeance on those who remove it. Ah, ancient Hocus Pocus. Forget this nonsense and come over here. I don't count poison darts and triggered entombment, your average Charles Tea Party. I feel we should lend this some respect. Ah, and you are the world-famous archaeologist adventurer Lara Croft, yeah? No, no, I am the renowned archaeologist. Just adventurer, Werner von Croy, and you will do as I say. Go to the wall and pull the lever. What was it you said? Disrespect is the route to carelessness? I am weary of this. Pull the lever now, Miss Croft. On your head be it, von Croy. Have faith in experience, child, and you will learn more than simple...
I, Semeket, High Priest of Horus, forewarn that he who removes the, the amulet, amulet shall have released said. He who walked abroad with the jackals at the dawn of man shall once again violate the earth. Harvests fail under the broken skies. My trusty companion returns. The amulet woman! Once called forth, shall the heavens split asunder, and the light of the sun, god Horus, banish the lord of darkness, set. I wouldn't advise it. woman has outsmarted you, yeah? And now she escapes. The amulet, Herr von Croy. It talks of the priest, Semerket. Semerket. Jean-Yves, my faithful friend. I fear this is not a social visit. Only if you want Von Croy gate-crashing the party. Von Croy? I think he was looking for this. The Amulet of Horus. An almost legendary artifact. So, you have found and opened the tomb of Set. This doesn't bode well. Translating from the Hebrew, he who removes the amulet shall once more release the dark power of Set. 
and said sayeth, I am the shadow across the sun, I am the bringer of plagues, my wrath will consume all lands and shall be ceaseless. The power to summon the sun god Horus to rebind the evil set shall only be revealed to the bearer of the amulet within the temple of Seneket at Karnak. The ceremony is complete as the armor of Horus summons the sun god. The armor of Horus. At the dig site in Alexandria, my men talk fearfully of this. The armor must also be von Croy's goal. Only one so ignorant of the prophecies would double with such a prehistoric evil. Ah, yes. Releasing set. But how could you have known, my dear? Time to put things right and remove a thorn in my side in the process. Miss Croft! Von Croy. You sound concerned, my dear. Have you misplaced something? Nothing I shan't be retrieving at a later date, Lieber. <laughs> you know how I admire your perseverance, but I fear this time we may be testing it to the, uh, how would you say, Maxim. Always griping, Werner. If it's the leg causing all this resentment, I seem to remember that being down to your affinity with pulling hazardous levers. Enough of this tedious banter, Miss Croft. It is time for you to realize... Miss Croft? Now, let us review your sprinting skills. For I have served the god of light, Horus, at the time of plagues. To read this inscription means that the ruler of darkness is free. Set is released to walk abroad amongst the mortals, enlisting his armies of the night to serve him. He who removes the amulet and releases the dark power of Set shall summon the sun god Horus, for only the power of light will again imprison him. By the power of the amulet and armor of Horus shall set the ever living be confined for all eternity.
summon the light of horrors through the light of the millennial constellations into his temple beneath the ageless pyramid into his likeness set in stone with his armament and his armor he is once more poised to battle and defeat set Hands on your head. Take me to Von Croy. Where's he headed? You waste your time. This attitude problem. You people need to learn some manners. Tell me now, or you've just run out of time. Uh, Alexandria. <laughs> Your workforce is about to be delayed. La, you are alive. I fear for you. What's... Von Croy has the amulet. Ah, this is bad. But he doesn't yet have the armor. There is still time to prepare for set. Jean, I'm tired. Give a girl a break. My dear, when all this is over, you can retire. But now we must move swiftly. My men dive in the bay for remnants of Cleopatra's lost palaces. Cleopatra? Yes. She realized the armor's significance and had it brought here. Some was subsequently scattered, but... And where would you recommend I start looking? In the catacombs under Alexandria. My diggers have unearthed chambers connected to the Great Library. This would hold the true location of Cleopatra's palaces. We have yet to find a way in, but you... Take me there. There is a problem. Von Croy. Yes. His dig is expanding, crossing many of my own tunnels. Of course, my men would no longer work when Von Croy's thugs appeared on the scene. Time to introduce myself to Werner's loyal workforce. First, you must get into the catacombs. Von Croy has them completely sealed up, and I fear he will soon have the armor. Over my dead body. This I fear also. I shall wait here for news. Return if you feel I can help in any way. Good luck, Clara. I fear you may need it. I make my own luck.
More information? Oui? I believe some of the armor could be here in the town. <clears throat> a local collector had a small exhibition and was rumored to own a piece. It's hard to say if this is true. The man was a fool. A while back, he vanished, leaving the exhibition boarded up. So, if Von Croy hasn't got to it, perhaps this would be the place to begin. Lara, I've been doing some reading and it is highly probable that some of the armor is hidden down in the catacombs themselves. But you must take care. Word of Von Croy's men fleeing the tunnels has reached me. Set separations have begun to move into the city, gathering at the ancient sites. You must hurry and find the library. Greetings, Lara. Remember, somewhere in the library will be the means to guide you to the location of Cleopatra's palaces. Von Croy will not know you have found the library yet, but I have heard, through connections, that he has hired new local help and is doubtless searching for another way in. For the moment, we have the advantage. But I fear you must move quickly if we are to stay ahead. Remember, the Great Library was very much like a university to ancient Alexandria. It will be full of knowledge, puzzles and invention. You will need quick wits to get through. Good luck, my friend. The tablet was returned to the sands that had spawned it beneath the city. The citadel of Saladin in ancient Cairo, foretelling of the time in the distant millennia when the stars of Orion come together, the ceremony is performed and set entombed. Hello, my dear. Another unannounced visit. I see you have found the scroll we unearthed. Interesting reading, yeah? Only interesting if you know what it refers to. Yes, yes, quite correct, my dear. The armor on its own is no more than a curiosity. But with the amulet and the ceremonial tablet, it becomes an important historical artifact, predating the Bible by centuries. There is more at stake here than the sum of the pieces, Von Croy. Ever heard of Armageddon? Unpleasant, even by your standards. Rebinding the spirit of Set, putting the armor on the statue at midnight at the turn of the millennium, so on and such like. I was never a believer in this magical hocus pocus. Fools after her! You have most truly put Von Croy's nose out of joint this time. If events were less catastrophic, I would be very happy. As it is, we must now be even more careful. He will become more desperate and thus more dangerous. Be on your guard. Use the artifact to get into the Cleopatra's palaces and find the rest of the armor. Tread carefully now. And not too much sizing. Hmm?
Congratulations! You survived to fight another day. I trust that you now have all the armor. Jean-Yves shall be escorting us to Cairo, not entirely of his own free will, I admit. A simple trade, his life for the armor of Horus. Do not take too long thinking it over. Yours apologetically, Werner. banged into a couple of them. They appear to have sealed off all the exits. Yes. Yes, this... this is good. You must help us to... 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 <coughs> to liberate the city. I'm just here for directions. I need a route to the Citadel. This is not so good. This is where the main activity takes place. Activity? We encountered it as the skies began to darken. A creature from our ancient past. It tore through my men like a firestorm. I managed to station our ammunition truck before the beast with a mind to ignite the explosive device in the rear. But with renewed vigor, it forced us back. It was as if it knew of our plans. Beast or no beast, Sarge. I've got to get into that building. You have spirit. Perhaps, as we retreated, we, we have mined some of the streets to, to prevent contamination. Two of my men are still in the area, out by the northern cemetery. One of them holds the frequency for the mine detector. The other holds the second half of the code for the explosive device. And if I find them? Tell them Sergeant Aziza sent you. I heard your motorbike. Once you have the codes, take me on it to the ammunition truck. I shall eradicate the blockage. But hurry, I am not long of this world. Your bike will need modifications to clear some of the larger obstacles. Nitrous oxide connected to the carburetor should give you the extra punch. Go, guy. Bring me the codes. Put your gun away. Aziza sent me. Uh, help me, English. I bleed to death. I try to hide, but those things smell the blood on me. I've come for the mine frequency. I need to get back to Aziza through this rabbit warren, with both legs intact. <laughs> I do a good job with the mines. Uh, not that it does us any good. We are all dead or half dying. Where are the rest of you? I need the explosive codes. Saida, my colleague, lies across the roof bridge in the mosque as we retreated. Something new that we had not encountered before came from the shadows like lightning and took his head. The codes? Ah, inside his head, inside the creature. I need those codes. Search his body. I don't know. Leave me now, for I am weak and wish to prepare myself.
for my god. A strong woman. Lara, and you handle yourself pretty well, Sergeant. You've got the codes? What now? After all we've been through, I think not. This is merely insurance. Against what? Against your stopping me from doing my duty. Somebody needs to drive that truck in there. Kamikaze. Whatever it takes for my country. In the next life, then, my friend. Thank God you made it. Von Croy. I saw it myself. I would not believe such a thing. He's possessed of Set. Get out of here, Sean. I have a feeling things may turn nasty. He's digging under the citadel, into the Crusader's vaults, in search of the ceremonial tablet. The tablet which contains Set's binding incantations. Be careful, Lara. I fear there are things in the vaults man was not meant to see. I'm not a man, Jean, and I'm always very, very careful. And in return? I will grant you vigor as those around you fall. You shall command the ultimate power and of life or death over those you choose at your side. And in return, they will bow at your feet and give worship. Got my fair share of that already. And besides, give a jackal your hand and he'll bite off the whole arm. Barking mad. The inscription reads, 
one night, in dreaming, came to me the spirit of the Sphinx. In his passing, he spoke unto me words of great wisdom. Tutmosis, here is your true destiny. This land of Egypt is forever yours to rule. In return, protect me always from the sands of time. As you are, I must be free from head to toe, so that we both may see the divine beauty of creation. I thought I was dead for sure. Please, for your own safety, take these keys and hide in the pyramid of Minkari. Save yourself from these abominations.
quickly, girl, before it collapses around you. You back, Werner? No more set? No time. Your hand, Lara. Give me your hand. Take my hand. I can pull you to safety. Good to see you again, Werner. I couldn't leave you!